tortoises may not be the first animal you think of when you think of the Arizona landscape, but they're one of the most integral species here in the Sonoran Desert. Sarah Blue has more about some research into these desert dwellers. This Sonoran Desert tortoise who makes his home at the Arizona Game and Fish Department can move surprisingly fast. This is one reason that another group of tortoises in the McDowell Mountains are being tracked with GPS units stuck to their shells. This three-year study at the Sonoran McDowell Conservancy looks at their day-to-day and sometimes night movements. We found the tortoises were moving at night, which was really cool and something we didn't know before. And we also got um, photo evidence of other wildlife using tortoise burrows, uh, like skunks and Gila monsters, lizards, other small mammals. These findings help show how essential the species is here in the desert. They provide like a snapshot of the health of the ecosystem. So um, if the desert tortoises are not doing well or not thriving, typically indicates that there is an issue with the entire ecosystem as well. Tortoise populations are currently at healthy levels, according to Chad Rupke of the Arizona Game and Fish Department. Populations are pretty stable. Um, even though we've seen declines in some areas, we've seen upticks in other areas. The McDowell study currently tracks 22 tortoises, 10 of which are juveniles. Soon, volunteers will remove the radio telemetry equipment as tortoises burrow for the winter. But they'll get their tracking devices back in the spring of next year, so researchers can continue their work. In Phoenix, Sarah Blue, Cronkite News. There is one year left in this program. After that, the Sonoran McDowell Conservancy hopes to extend the project into a long-term study to further understand tortoise movement.